today's video I'm coming to you with blow dry hair because I am going to be using my color that I got from Curl Smith to do like a nice little braid out and I wanted to add it to blow dry hair so I still get that in elongated look. So this is what my hair is looking like blow dried. I also did a little trim but it wasn't that crazy. This is what it's looking like from the front. Is what it's looking like from the back hopefully you guys can see that but yeah so what i'm going to do i will be using the um curl smith curl conditioner oil and cream leave-in cream for curly or coily hair this is supposed to moisturize nourish and add shine to the hair and i'm going in with their copper color color rest their hair makeup and then I will be going in with their hair makeup. This is in the color copper from Curl Smith also. So I want a little bit of moisture and hopefully it will, um, you know, keep those braids in place that I plan on putting in and then the color. So those together should be pretty good. All right, so I don't want these um, too small or too big. So I'm gonna make like, maybe like four sections on each side of my head. Let me know if you guys have ever used the co uh, color before, um, any of them. I have all of them now, so I will eventually try all of them. So yeah, this is the first section I'm going to do. This is my first time using all of these products. The Curl Smith comes with like a little seal, and it's pretty thick too. It's really thick, so I'm not going to use too much. Probably put some of that back. So I want to dampen my hair just a little bit with product, but... Not too much. Okay, I need a little bit more than that. Who was I? I think I was fooling. It's very thick. I'm probably going to add more than what I said I was. I have to go on with the color. You can see it like when it's in the light. I feel like there's more on my fingers than my hair right now. And you can kind of see it. I think it would be better in the light. I'm going with some more. I only need to do this once, so I want to make sure there's enough on my hair. So I keep going in. Because I don't want it to be like kind of splotchy. I really want it on my ends. I gotta open the hair too, make sure it's in there. Alright. I think that's good. Now I'll just braid it. I want like a wave look. All right, so I got one braid down and I'm gonna just do that all over my head and I'll be back when I'm done. All 
All right, guys, so this is what half my hair is looking like. I did one, two, three, four, five braids. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I did five braids instead of four. Um, And the color is showing up good. It looks like I had it in for a while. Like, it's not, like, brand new looking. It's not super bright as of right now, but we'll see how my hair looks when I take it down. But this is just, like, a comparison of, you know, like, the color. You can really see it compared to my black so I'm gonna just finish up and um, take it down tomorrow all right guys so this is what my hair is looking like taken down and picked and fluffed and all that stuff and I gotta say I really really do love it my hair feels so good so like amazing and moisturized um, there's not a lot of transfer but there is some when you touch your hair a lot my dog is going off at the door but yeah, these two products are really, really moisturizing. And if you guys want to see me try the other colors, let me know. All right, guys, so I'm here with like day six here. And I just wanted to show you how the color withheld in my hair. And so what I did every night was moisturize so that my hair would stay moisturized. And I did like twist outs, braid outs, all that stuff like every night. And I didn't do too much like the tangle with a brush and stuff, but I did some. This is what my brush looked like. It has some of the color on it, but it didn't really transfer that that much. Also, I've been wearing this sweater all day and the transfer is not that bad. Like you can barely see it. I will say that at the end of the week, it started to turn into balls, the color. So whenever I touch my hair, it would be balls of color. So it wasn't that bad, the transfer, and the color did stay pretty good. And I didn't reapply at all. So this is what you're seeing from the first day. Like I haven't applied anymore. I was just, Going in with the oil and cream, conditioning and cream. And I used a good amount, like just moisturizing every day. Although I didn't really need it because my hair is moisturized. But anyways, this is what my hair is looking like. This is the end of this color. And if you guys want to see the other colors and how they hold up, just like this video, comment, and all that stuff. And if you guys like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye, guys.